What's up guys? I am going to do an update on my blue piano. As you can see, it has changed a lot. A whole lot. Let's close that. So, that's probably all the keys for you. Remember that top one doesn't work. I've actually put a key top on it now. This is off this piano, because this piano got a new set of keys. I can't really open it because it's got a cover on it. But I'll show you that piano at some point. Let's play all the keys. Top one still doesn't work, but I just wanted to put a key on that so it looked good. It's a different color. This note doesn't work because it has a broken string. So, as you can see, there's a new set of... Um, Lights on this piano. I just turned that one to cyan so it matches these ones. So, starting, I'm going to start with the hammers. I painted the backs of the blue ha blue hammer, the backs of the hammers, and the back checks. And haven't really had, had a few bridle straps replaced since last time, if you will notice, which are these things right here. This one here is popped in this one right here. I am going to replace them, but I need some time to do it. I want to try and do it with the action in because I do have mics behind this action. <clears throat> and the cords run straight through the action that was touching the strings. That's why I moved it. It runs right for the action and it's tied there and it goes way through the back there and it's nailed to the top, both of them and the connect device connect cord that usually is up here. Let me just put that up where it's supposed to be. Yeah. Looks like that when it's up. I just hook it over this tad that holds the cover on this light fixture. So two bridle straps are being replaced. This one is um, a copper wire. Um, this one also I've I've been having a problem with the pin slipping out of the um, flange. The hammer flange keeps falling out. But all the hammers are good. This one here has been fixed at some stage. I don't know if I told you in the last uh, in the last video I did of this piano. This hammer here has been fixed. If you can see in there. As you can see it's a different, it's silver instead of the wood. It's got a bit of silver tape wrapped around the... It's also wood glued on there, so it's nice and strong. But it's a little higher up than the other hammer, so... I think it's kind of hitting the um, bar right here. But that's alright. I've added the speaker. The speaker's been screwed in here. Let's just open this lid real quick. It's been... It's not screwed on, but there's a screw there, and there's a nail there holding it in. One in the pinhole there where the tuning pins were. Because those tuning pins were loose anyway. That one I am going to fix at some point. It's just I need to find the string for it. So I am going to replace that string soon. But I don't know if I have the right size string. So So the LEDs, I added them yesterday. They're color changing. They're set on cyan. That one's been in here for a while. So I, was, I put the mics in last week. And also I do TikToking on this piano. I'll show you my TikTok account name is on the underside of the sled. Jeep Wrangler 46. Go and search that up on TikTok. Do it. I need more followers. This does keep coming off at this end, but I am gonna sort that. Probably some super glue will help. These keys are bit up a little bit. I am going to replace them at some point. But as you can see with this one, that one there was chipped, but I took the one off this one here and I put it in the middle. Since this one won't get as bit up down here, it is also a little bit out of tune. Didn't even notice that. But it's got a bit of chip. It's chipped a little bit. So this one here is chipped as well. That one's got a crack in it. This one's broken. 
A few of these keys are like that. This one here is starting to break off again. It's coming off, but that doesn't really matter. This one here has a crack in it as well. Because these are actually the original ivories to this piano. That one's bit up too. I did start replacing these key fronts. I'm using the older ones off the piano over there. To try to get a few of these back for now. I am going to replace them anyway, so... I haven't really glued them on as hard, so I can take them back off. That one's chipped. I did start taking it off and didn't really complete it. This one here is already removed. It's just white. That one there is gone. These have just been missing for a long time. But that's alright. Don't even notice. It still works. And the um, cords to the lights go down through the hole down here for these LEDs and they go down into the bottom of the piano in there. I'm not going to take that board off because it is extremely hard to get it back on because it's swollen up. And it also comes out the back down here. I didn't want to, I was going to drill for the soundboard but I changed my mind and I don't want to wreck my 1985 Campbell New York piano. Let me show you the brand name on it. Let's just pop this lid. Hold it up with my head. I'm going to show you the logo. It has the Jeep logo over it. This is just um, reasons. There's the logo. I'm going to tape it back up. Maybe I'm not going to be able to tape it back up. Let me put the camera down. So I do. the reason I do put that over the logo, and that's over the um, serial number, the other one, is um, it prevents me from getting sued or so for like having the brand, piano brand and logo and I don't really do it with this piano but because I can just open the music rack on this one because I don't take this one apart this one just stays together it also has the logo on the inside too and it's bigger on that one so I do have a bit of card to cover that one's logo on the inside if I do have the lid open for recording because I do just open the lid on that one but got the speaker in there thanks for watching sorry this video would have been a bit boring also got that up there like that just hang from the light that's my little plugs it's a crappy thing thanks for watching blue